Art This is pretty much as tremendous as a sea, exemplifying a wide scope of exercises. For example, painting, photography, engineering, and so on. Art has consistently been around in some structure, helping humankind in the improvement of assorted exercises and their results. On the off chance that we investigate our past with the headway of time, let us go back and see arts again as old as these feelings have been shown, these most wonderful kinds of performing expressions. Now let us talk about traditional art of Region 11. Beside me is one of Davao de Oro's best, inspired by the Maguindanawan known as Inaol of 1930. This Inaol beside me is purchased by our late Lola Constancia of the early 90s. This woven cloth is originally from Maguindanao, but is adapted by the people here in Davao de Oro. It tells us that the Inaol doesn't just provide us colorful and intricately designed cloth. This symbolizes the social status, bravery and valor, and of course, pride and dignity of the people using it. It even tells a story, or perhaps a dream, that came lost into the wandering thoughts of the one who waved this. Well, for me, this is the most beautiful thing that came from the lost wonders. What's unique about this traditional art is that when we look into details, we see that it's customary, it's both culturally and regionally specific, and it's historical. An art that is community-based. This Inaol has been with us for almost a century now. And the tradition of passing this to our youngsters will remain as this traditional art remained. One of the couple most famous and worth bragging contemporary artwork and craftsmanship of Region 11 is this one beside me. This is by the great Victor Bastriquina of 2012, named Win, Place or Show, Derby Horse Race. According to Victor, this is particularly after no one. Though in particular, we can see horses racing and battling for their lives, unconscious of the real reason why. But for Victor, generally citing this is us. The people, the humanity. We run our own races, we struggle our own battles. We keep on going because we know that these battles are factors that could lead us to victory. What's rare about this contemporary art is that it is made during the 21st century by a living artist. It is also an easel arts, a new media, and innovative. This kind of art reflects on the ideas and perspectives that are vulnerable to social change. This contemporary art can take many forms and be represented in a variety of media. Contemporary craftsmanship is a workmanship delivered at the current time frame on schedule. As we see through the details of an art, we can see materials that haven't been existed before. This concludes that such of an art was made today and is adaptive to the use of news resources. Having this kind of art in our home is something that I can surely brag to a lot of people. This is because contemporary arts like this doesn't just tell you about horses. It tells you stories that are beyond imaginations. Stories that are beyond the pictures that is shown. And might as well stories that you can reflect in every day that passes by. Traditional and contemporary arts may be a very much opposing to each other. Yet, these arts can be both revolutionary. These are those that brought changes and impacts to our lives. They both use as art elements such as color, lines, movements, and so on to portray and send messages to its audience. Most of all, it is both something that we should cherish and preserve.